I put these two things in to make sure that you see the nav bar is in here. So I've got the container fluid, the nav bar, and if I open it up, you'll see that's all these, the information for the nav bar. If we look at it in live, we'll see we've got a nav bar in it. But now I'm going to go into code for a bit, and I want to make sure I'm after the nav bar. So I've made sure that that's shut down, and I'm going to put in a couple of, I'm going to first put in a responsive image. And I think actually I'm going to put in a grid row with column, and I'm going to do it nested, and I'm going to do, come on, one column. Okay. Now when he does it, his, and it comes up, it's defaulting to large. Make sure that this is column large 12, and content goes here. And we go to live, we look at it, it looks like this. Okay, so far so good. We can do one of two things. We can either shut this down, and I'm going to... Copy it, and I'll go on to the next one, and paste it. And paste it. Okay, so now if I go to live, I'll see I've got content goes here, content goes here, content goes here. I'm going to name them so I can tell what they are, so I'm going to shut this one down. There's my first one. Open it up. Content goes here. Now, we don't need to do that one because we put a pick there. This one, we're going to change this to left. And this one, we're going to change to right. Okay, so when we look at this lot in live, you'll see we've got content goes here, left and right. And that's really what we're looking for as we're setting this up. Now with the first one that says content goes here, we're going to add a responsive image. And again, I will shut down these so I don't see them. There's div class row, and then this is the one I want open. It says content goes here. I'll take that out. Hit return, return, so I've got some good space there so I can see it. And I'm going to throw in a responsive image. Oh, come on. Okay. It went a little crazy on me, so no. Okay. Now this is where you have to be a little careful. Oh, this body, the nav for some reason open. I want row. This is where I want open. I want this one open. Okay, and I'm going to put my responsive. Okay, fine. You want to do that? Okay, so where is it? Okay. Let's open this up. This is where I want to be. Click on responsive image. There it goes. It went in. It was just being difficult. Um, and again, I want to make sure that's inside my div class. All right. Interesting. It seems to be giving me a couple of divs, but let's see if it works. Yep, it's working just fine. So it's got a placeholder, and the placeholder isn't doing much. So if we go File, Save All. It is saving this as home. I'm going to place it. There we go. Okay. So this is what we've got so far. 